Can you treat seborrheic keratoses at home? Have you ever noticed a waxy, stuck and patch on your skin and wondered what it is? You might be looking at a seborrheic keratosis. These benign growths are quite common and usually harmless. Many people want to remove them for cosmetic reasons or if they become bothersome. So, can you treat seborrheic keratoses at home? Let's break it down. Seborrheic keratoses do not requiring medical treatment since they are not cancerous. However, if you want to address their appearance, there are some at-home options to consider. It is essential to consult a dermatologist before starting any treatment. This ensures that you are not confusing these growths with more serious skin conditions. While dermatologists offer treatments like cryotherapy, laser therapy, or shave excision, some topical products may be used at home. Over-the-counter options exist, but their effectiveness can vary. Some ointments, creams, and gels claim to reduce the appearance of these growths. However, results can differ from person to person. One topical solution that dermatologists may prescribe for home use contains 40% hydrogen peroxide. This concentration is effective, while lower concentrations found in common household products will not work. Other treatments, like maxicalcitol, tazarotene cream, and potassium dobsalate, are also options but usually requiring a prescription and monitoring by a healthcare provider. Another at home treatment involves a combination of 5 fluorouracil, which is often abbreviated as 5 fu at 2.5% and salicylic acid at 17%. This regimen is similar to wart treatments. You would apply the medication at night and wash it off in the morning. Treatment typically lasts three to seven days, depending on the size and thickness of the seborrheic keratosis. Some stinging may occur due to the salicylic acid, but it is usually tolerable. It is essential to avoid applying this medication to normal skin to prevent irritation. Remember, self-treatment without medical advice is not recommended. A dermatologist can confirm the diagnosis and rule out any serious conditions. They can also suggest the safest and most effective treatment options tailored to your needs. In summary, while there are some at-home treatments for seborrheic keratosis, they should only be used under the guidance of a healthcare professional. Always consult a dermatologist before attempting any at-home treatment for skin growths.